leaders in the Franklin County area are looking to the future with a possible co-working space in Rocky Mount. More people are looking at work from home setups and they'd love them to leave the big city for our region. 10 News reporter Shane Dwyer shows us the early plans. So I'm an environmental consultant. Um, I have worked from home for about six years now. Danielle White lives in rural Franklin County, and this is her humble home office. She loves her setup, but it's not always perfect. First and foremost, the internet service. And then um, when you have worked from home for an extended period of time, sometimes it's nice to get out of the house. She's part of a growing group of people leaving the office behind and working from home. Franklin County Economic Development Director Beth Sims says the Roanoke Regional Partnership recently ran a remote work marketing campaign and it drew 45,000 clicks. We know that there are people who are looking to move from more dense areas to less dense areas um, to more affordable areas. Um, and we think Franklin County is a great place, place to live. Uh, and yeah, we're trying to get a slice of that. Earlier this week, Rocky Mount Town Council approved a request for proposals for a co-work space. It would be grant funded and live in this building on Church Street next to the farmer's market. So we imagine it'll be more like a co-working business incubator space. So there will be open concept office space for people to just come in and use their laptops. And we imagine that'll be more of an affordable option. But then there'll also be private. We imagine there'll be private office space too. Sim says bottom line, new residence means more revenue for the region. A small group of teleworkers already meet at the local coffee shop, and White says they're ready to be customers of the new space. Um, we like to go there just to get out of the house and work, um, but it's hard to take conference calls in the coffee shop, so I think there's going to be quite a few people in the area that are excited to utilize the space. In Rocky Mount, Shane Dwyer, 10 News, working for you. Sims says the space would also benefit already existing businesses in the region because there is not a surplus surplus of available office space.